Dr. Manjunath Malige, consultant endocrinologist and diabetologist. I would like to talk to you a, a few things about diabetes and heart failure. Heart failure is a condition where the heart fails to pump enough blood to keep up the circulation of the blood to various parts of the body. Diabetes is one of the important risk factors for the development of heart failure and diabetes increases the risk of heart failure by two to five fold. In patients who have heart failure, presence of diabetes indicates a worse prognosis in that the sequence of events can be quite rapid in terms of worsening of heart failure and repeated admissions to the hospital with symptoms of heart failure. Heart failure typically presents with shortness of breath while at rest or while doing an activity, swelling of the legs and tiredness. One of the major risk factors as I mentioned for heart failure is diabetes and it's very important to see your endocrinologist and get your diabetes under good control to reduce the risk of developing heart failure. The way diabetes causes heart failure is sort of very well known scientifically now. It increases the deposition of cholesterol in the blood vessels throughout the body, particularly those that supply the blood to the heart and thereby reduces the blood supply to the heart muscle, which in time leads to heart attack and heart failure. So the base point is to make sure that the diabetes is well controlled so that your risk of increased deposition of cholesterol in the blood vessels and thereby heart attack and heart failure can be significantly reduced. About 70% of the patients with the diabetes have hypertension as well, that's high blood pressure. It's important that blood pressure is kept under control to reduce the risk of heart failure and in patients with diabetes, heart failure risk increases by about 14% by every 10 millimeters of mercury of increase in the systolic blood pressure. Thank you.